Thank you. Welcome back. My guest today is a cheating lover is one you must keep on a very tight leash. Please welcome Amy to the show. She says her enemy can't run or hide on our stage. Amy, what's going on? Well, Jerry, I'm a single mom. I have a beautiful yeah. two-year-old daughter. Yeah. And it's really hard to find somebody that will take in somebody with a child. And I found a great guy about a year ago yeah. that has been wonderful. I love him. My child loves him. Everything's yeah. been going wonderful. Until about a week ago, I was hearing rumors in my small town that he had cheated with the trailer park slut. Well, if you're going to cheat, shouldn't it be the trailer park slut? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay, so, wow. So, and you've been going with him for a year? Almost a year, yeah. Almost a year. Mm -hmm. And now, is this the first you suspected that he was cheating yeah, on you? Yeah, I live in a small town. Yeah. It takes like 30 minutes just to get to a grocery store. Yeah. So rumors are easy to get around. Sure. And uh, I tried confronting him about it, but he was like, I'm drunk, I don't remember, you know, what everybody says when they cheat. Yeah. And I didn't take that, so I told him to pack his stuff and leave and go to his grandparents' house so I can cool down. Afterwards, I called Carmen, which is the whore. Yeah. And, uh... <laughs> I just wanted to talk to her because we've been friends for about nine years. Yeah. And uh, I tried to confront her. I told her to meet us at the local boat dock just to talk. She pulls up and wouldn't even get out of the car. Oh. I was sitting there just banging on the window, about broke my that hand. That probably frightened her. Yeah. yeah and she's like, yeah. I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant with this kid. So I went and beat her up. <laughs> and so, you, so you wouldn't beat her up? Yes. Oh, uh, yeah. I thought you said you went to beat her up. So okay. You wouldn't beat her up. Okay. Afterwards, I... Uh, I know she's lying because in the past nine years, she's done this to many other girls. You know, she's oh. like, I'm pregnant, but she's really not. She's just scared. Yeah. So now you, uh, so, but you want to confront her here. Yeah, I'm ready to beat her ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, is she going to come out of the car? Because we can't get the car up here. Well, that's why I brought her on this stage. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, you think she really likes him? She wants. She's to saying she does, but she's also with my brother. Oh. And oh. They've been dating, I believe, for about four months. Uh, so she's not only hurt you, but and she, my child. Now, yeah, now she's hurt your brother because. Mm -hmm. your and brother... my brother and my boyfriend are like best friends. Oh, not anymore, I guess. I doubt it. All right, here she is. Carmen. You are a nasty whore. You know what? I am, but I'm not pregnant. I lied to you because I'm scared of you because you're freaking crazy. Yeah, because you're not. with your man three weeks ago because he came in my work and wanted to leave with me. Because you're easy. Uh, I might be easy, but I still got him, didn't I? Sure did. Whore. Yeah, and I'll take him again. He don't want you. Are you sure about that? We'll find out, won't we? Yeah, I guess what we will. What does he tell you about her, though? Because you know they're together and she's been your friend. When he come, came to see you, <coughs> what does he say about her? He says that she just doesn't please him like I can. <laughs> When you hear the, and how do you please him? You sing to him? You play chess with him? No. I don't have to sing. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, okay, so you sleep with him. But when you hear that, if she's telling the truth, what is, if, if he's going around telling people you don't please him, why do you want to be with him? Then? Well, I love him. Yeah, because you do love him. Yeah. He treats you well? I've been through a lot. Do you feel bad she's your friend? You know, really? I'm 19 years old, I have a three year old daughter. I've been tied down for three years. 
It's time for me to have I fun. I got a kid too. It's I ain't time for me to shine. Sleep with but other you've people. always had things handed to you, see? I've oh, had really? to work for everything I have. Well, let's meet him. Here's Jake. Yeah. <laughs> Baby. Baby, I'm sorry. You know I never meant to hurt you. Why'd you do that? I was drunk. So therefore, every little comes <laughs> flying your way, you're gonna do it? No, she kept throwing herself at me, baby. Oh! I deserve that. Damn straight. I love you. I you know I love you. You know I love that you. That ain't love. So you don't want to be- But wait a minute, I didn't hold a gun to your head and tell you to come home with me. You got me drunk. You know how I am when I'm drunk. I didn't, ma I didn't hold it to your mouth and say drink it, now did I? But you know I like to drink. You saw, I saw you at the Crackle Barrel and you invited me over to your house. <laughs> Yeah, you Is came that to the local hangout. That's my job. Oh, that's that's where job? I work. Oh, that's you... where I work. Oh, you work. Okay. Yeah. So I this work. was off hours that you. It wasn't like. You no, were... he came in and sat in my section and ate. Came in for me. He forgot to mention that. That's true. You you came to see her. I needed somebody to talk to. Why didn't you come to me? Because we were into it. All the time. What if I done that to marriage. you? What if I done that to you? How would you feel? If I brought you up, up here on this stage, me with another man. I'd stomp his damn ass is what I'd do. All right, then. I love you. All right. But you, because the next time you go to Cracker Barrel, because <laughs> that's, that's your weak spot, <laughs> then you're going you're gonna to cheat on her again. I'm never going to cheat on her again. Well, you're going to drink again, aren't you? Until he comes back to Cracker Barrel. I ain't never come back. I'll let you cry on my shoulder for nine years because you were a whore and there's other women out there that are in just like me in my shoes that you have down on. Sorry about my language. Well, you know what? It's my time. And I it can't... You don't matter. So he... Exactly. Exactly. I'm a girl that knows what I want and that's what I'm here for. Well, don't Half do it with my man. Birch wood. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Uh, so what's going to happen? How, how do you solve? How do you solve her problem? She knows that when you, because you've just admitted it, when you get drunk, you sleep with other women. I'll quit drinking if I have to to get her back, Jerry. I love her that much. <laughs> would you, would, would you stop at Cracker Barrel? Stop going to Cracker Barrel forever. <laughs> Cracker Barrel ain't got nothing on her cooking, I tell you. What about Applebee's? <laughs> All right. Now, wait a second. So, now you have a boyfriend, which is her brother. Is that true? Does he know about any of this? He, um, he found out, I guess, about a week ago, and um, I've kind of been ignoring him ever since. So you've basically, you've hurt your friend and you've also hurt her brother because you've cheated on your, 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 her brother. Here is Randy. Oh. Oh. Well, Randy bought new shorts. Hi, Randy. Oh, man. Good, sorry about your shirt. I've had a crush on you since I was nine years old. You used to make me blush every time you used to talk to me, every time you made me laugh. You know, what else am I supposed to do? I'm an 18-year-old standing here for you and your kid, and what other man's going to do that? You're my oh, dream trash. girl, and I loved you. I don't need anybody from there. My child, honey, you're 18 years old. You have a lot of growing up to do, and I'm ready for a man. You don't even know how I grew up. You ain't been through what I've been through, and you... You stayed at my house with my sister, my my niece, and you disrespected them, and you disrespected me, and you ran. I know you've been hiding at your grandma's. I wasn't hiding, brother. Because you're scared your of me. Your sister kicked me out is what happened. Where else am I going to go? And then why you been avoiding me? You've been my friend, too. You know I didn't mean to do it, Randy. <laughs> no, I didn't. You know I love your sister. You know more than anybody that I love your sister. And you've been good to her. That's why you need to man up and take your responsibilities and don't do nothing like that again. 
Well, Randy, you need to stay away from her, too. All she wants to do is have fun, be a whore. That's not what you were screaming the other night. Three weeks ago? No, he was screaming for pancakes. <laughs> okay, so you're saying you really want to be back with your girlfriend. Boy, so you have a decision to make whether you're going to take him back. You still want to be with her even though she cheated on you. I want to help her make herself better before she screws up her life the rest of the way. You can't wait tables for everybody. Be a prostitute, that'd be a good job for you. <laughs> Make good money there. We'll be back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.